agriculture program at Loyola is a one of a kind experience. It's been fantastic. You have people that come in very energetic, ready to learn, uh, but they typically don't know what to expect. So it's always some hard work waiting on the other side for them. And that's always great to see. You learn about food systems, you learn about the community. We ex like we talk to a lot of people at the farmer's market, people are always stopping by the garden. We learn about business through dealing with like restaurants. You learn all about soil and plant health, which I'm really interested in. Urban Ag is probably my favorite thing here at Loyola. So since the summer, I have expanded the hydro unit um, with the help of interns that we got. That is really exciting. We're gonna be able to double production. Over the summer, we were really battling with the warmer temperatures as climate change continues to escalate. We have to manage the temperatures because mycelium and mushrooms um, won't fruit above 90 to 95 degrees. So we were working to limit our energy input, but also um, keep our space air conditioned. We kept production up. We provided to the farmer's market, to our interns, and also to different um, donation-based programs in the area. Aquaponics specifically is the use of fish in a hydroponic system, you could say. It's a mix of aquaculture and hydroponics. So we use the fish's waste, basically, to fertilize the lettuce we grow. Over the summer, we started a sludge like research group. There's a lot of fish sludge buildup, which typically the plants use. So we're looking into extracting that and turning it into a fertilizer. And it's really like a cutting edge thing that we're super excited about. And it would be something we could use in all aspects of the program, not just AP. So that's really exciting. The program has been up to new things, new heights. And basically what that will look like is us having way more produce to offer. We harvest around 3,500 pounds a year. And roughly 15 to 2,000 pounds of that is going to food pantries and around 1,500 to 2,000 pounds is sold each year to restaurants and farmer's markets. Our food right now goes to the Edgewater Farmer's Market. When the farmer's market season ends, we will be donating our produce to the food pantry in Damon, and we'll also be selling to Archie's Cafe um, on West Loyola Ave. We don't want Loyola just being a school in the community that's not connected to the community. Since we're in the position that we're able to do that, I'm really excited that we're giving back to the community in a really like direct way.